One of the most underrated things about Hypixel Skyblock is the map design. I mean, just look at this map, dude. So many things to explore. You've got the multicolored wool shopkeeps. You've got the bank, which just looks sick. You've got the auction house. There's so much effort and creativity put into this map that every time I join Skyblock and I'm greeted by this hub, I feel so full of energy and I feel so adventurous because it's just, it looks amazing. The build team did a really good job with this. Oh man, anyway, welcome back to my series where I just completely ignore all of it. Welcome back to Hypixel Skyblock, but regular Skyblock, or vanilla Skyblock, or we can't leave our island, I don't know, this series goes by a lot of names. So it turns out 30 Virus and Fezzy the Frog, among a couple other people, have done sort of a similar video idea to this, which is actually pretty cool because, I'm gonna be honest, I know like nothing about Skyblock, so I'm glad some actual Skyblock creators gave this idea some attention. It is a pretty fun idea, although let's be honest, some of them are Skyblock tryhards. I know 30 got like way farther than I did in just his first hour, so we're already far behind even though I started this video series a couple weeks ago. <laughs> but you know what? Even though they got further than I did, I'm not gonna let them leave me completely in the dust. We're gonna grind this out. Okay, so I don't know if you guys already noticed, but uh, I made a fair amount of progress on trees and saplings. One of the good things though about people exploring this video idea is that a bunch of people found out like basically how far you could go without actually leaving your island in High Pixel Skyblock and you can get a lot of stuff done, I didn't realize. First of all, we're gonna be able to get a ton of minions just because of how many possible collections are in here. Die, die, die. 33 damage, dude. We're actually getting pretty close to a skeleton minion. Let's see. Yeah, we're actually like, we're almost right there. That's actually gonna be really good for us because getting that bone meal for crops is gonna make everything much faster. And if we get a, a potato from zombies, I'm not sure if uh, zombies on Hypixel Skyblock actually drop regular potatoes, but I don't know. Come on. Come on. Yes. Okay. So that one dropped a poisonous potato. I don't know if they drop regular potatoes, but that's the only way we can get any sort of potato. All right. So one of the things I wanted to work on for this episode was getting just a huge area for hostile mobs to spawn in because that's going to be the main way we're going to get uh, more mobs and more collections unlocked is if we have a giant area for the mobs to spawn in. Additionally, and thank you for all the people who pointed this out, we can actually get regular passive mobs like pigs, cows, and chickens if we have a grass platform. So uh, we don't actually have have that much dirt we're gonna have to repurpose it but it is completely possible to get pig minions and get a pigman sword and a bunch of other things a piggy bank even though you have no reason to have coins another thing that's actually pretty cool that i didn't actually know about is if you craft an auto smelter which is really easy to do you might be asking oh Omicron, how'd you get coal a uh, coal is actually really easy to get because there's a trade for it if you have oak wood you can get uh, coal by trading it but you don't actually need to trade all your oak wood every time what you can do is you can put an auto smelter in this little guy this oak wood minion and it'll actually make coal, which which makes sense. Because burning wood equals coal, not charcoal, whatever, I don't know. So I believe if we just put this in this guy, it'll just smelt these into coal. Now the big question I had about this was, do you get collection if you collect that coal? Because if you get collection from the coal, that means we unlock the entire coal collection, which would be fantastic. The key to this challenge is really to just unlock as many collections as possible, because you're obviously very limited not being able to- Okay, well, nice job. Omicron. You're obviously pretty limited not being able to go to the hub island, so how many collections can you really get if you're just staying on your island? And this is the most pointless challenge anyway, because even if you are able to get good armor and a good sword like a Pikmin sword, you can't make an enchant table, you can't get sugar cane, so you're unable to make books, you can't enchant any of your armor, and you can't even go to the blacksmith in the hub to reforge anything. So pretty much what I'm trying to say is that we can get a Pikmin sword, but it's gonna have to be a clean Pikmin sword. Alright, let's just stick with this for now. This is a pretty decent large platform, so hopefully it'll do. Also have to get that that grass platform going. There should be a trade for it. Yeah, if you trade four dirt, you can get four grass, so that's convenient. Let's check on our oak wood minion. And as you can see, you just, you get coal because of reasons. And if I collect it, you get collection. Oh my God, that is so good. Oh my God, that's actually so good. This unlocks a lot of things. We could get an enchanted lava bucket. <laughs> Because you can get iron from zombies. All you have to do is just get a frick ton of coal and iron, and then suddenly you have the frickin' one of the better items for minions in the game. I don't know if the admin's intended for this, because this is- that's just- that's so convenient, actually. You- you just get the collection. Oh my god! And if we can get a chicken minion from chicken eggs, we can get a super enchanted egg, it'll just take forever. We could get a wither skeleton pet. We can actually get a ton of pets. I didn't realize this before. And our wheat's growing too. This is fantastic. And we get more bones from a skeleton minion. <gasps> no! <laughs> uh, if we get more bones from a skeleton minion, then we can speed up the growing process. We might actually be able 
It actually might be possible to get uh, a skeleton minion going tonight. That, that would be great. Yeah, one of the reasons Fezzy and 30 passed me so quickly in progress is because I was too busy uh, building a house. So, but you know what? Do they have a home? That's what I thought. I have a house. Their house sucks because they don't have one. All right, we got more mobs over here. I don't have a guardrail, which is going to be a... P Did that spider fall off the map? <sighs> you know, sometimes you just forget it's skyblock. You forget that you're stranded like five billion feet in the air. Come, come on. Bones, 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 bones. Bones. Okay, it'd be really cool if you drop like a carrot or an iron ingot or something. That's... That ain't it. I'm wondering, can you actually get iron from zombies in Skyblock? I don't I don't know if I've ever heard of someone ever getting that, but uh, in vanilla you can get iron from zombies and also carrots and potatoes, poisonous potatoes, all that stuff. But I, I don't know about high pixel skyblock. I'm not I'm not sure. Yeah, watch me use a magic fine pot so I can get iron from zombies in Skyblock. Mm -hmm. No, I knocked you that way. Yeah, I kind of went crazy with the tree farm off camera. I had just had a bunch of saplings lying around and I didn't want to trade them all for leaves. So I just, I just made a big forest. Man, I really need to explain. No. <sighs> mobs, I, I don't understand. Mobs just have absolutely no IQ whatsoever. Thank you. Another thing that people were telling me to do was to dismantle the portal and then remove this entire hub island, but honestly, I kind of like the idea of just having this this portal island right here the entire time while I completely progress without ever going to the hub. Come on. Come on. Come on. Mm. Mm. Okay. 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 Cool. 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 I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. <laughs> Fortunately, we have no use for coins because it's not like, you know, the shop exists here. No, you've, you've got to be, you're, okay. This game just lives to see hopes and dreams just decay away a little bit like my health. See, it's weird because if I collect this, it'll give me mining XP, which doesn't really make any sense. I think the game just looks at it like a regular coal minion. I don't know though. All right, we're going to mine more trees and then we also got to get a grass platform situated because I would like some vanilla mobs to spawn. <sighs> but my house though, my house, it just looks so good and I don't want to remove this little grass garden I have outside. But I will for the name of science. It isn't too big of a problem though because if we lose dirt We can actually just get a dirt uh, trade from the seeds collection So once we get crops going, we'll have a ton of dirt. All right, give me coal and we're actually hold on So it'll mine one more tree and then we should just unlock the first level of the coal collection I don't know. What do you guys think? Should I go for more collections? Should I make a mob grinder? Should I? Build a second layer to my house? I don't know, just tell me in the comments. I know a lot of YouTubers will say that so that more people will comment and then their video gets recommended more, but please, I'm actually desperate for video ideas. I have no idea what I want to do here. All right, so we're mining more trees and because of that, we're getting more saplings, which is actually going to be a pretty key thing in what I'm going to do next. Oh, hey, Omicron, I didn't know if you knew about this, but there's actually this one armor set that's very easy to unlock from the wood collection, and all you need to do is you just need to get some leaves. Oh, there's also a leaf, a leaf trade in the, in the, in the, in the, the, the collection thing. There, I made it, okay? I made leaflet armor. You guys happy? You guys happy? I'm kidding. That was sort of a joke, but do you have any idea how many people commented that on my video and 30s video about how, oh, you can, you guys can make leaflet armor, you just have to get leaves, and you can get that from saplings, it's a trade, it's it's really easy to craft. Yes, yes, we know that you can make leaflet armor, but why Why would you want leaflet armor? You get more health, more health, more health, more health, and it's, it's, it's like barely double your base health. It literally gives you no defense, and the full set bonus doesn't even apply to me because I have to go to the hub, which is where the forest is. I mean, I guess Pog, you know, first armor set of the series. It's, it's a bad armor set, but it's, it's an armor set. You want to know it is Pog. Coal minion recipes, dude. Let's go. <laughs> but like, do I even want this? Do I want a coal minion? Because this guy is, is pretty much just a budget coal minion and he produces at a faster rate than a coal minion one. I mean, I'll make one. I have to make one for the minion slots anyway, so we might as well just, you know, get a coal minion. But I'm pretty sure we could have just used the oak minion for everything. I'm still gonna craft this though. And you go there. Oh my god, let's freaking go, dude. We have 2 out of 16 mining collection unlocked, which considering we haven't left our island is not bad at all. I have leaflet armor. You can't kill me. And my bones just... Oh my god, dude. <gasps> we got it. We actually got it, though. Oh, <laughs> let's go. <gasps> An enderman. Oh my god, no way. Actually, so I didn't talk about this. I did already unlock the ender pro collection. Um, which is, which is, which is pretty pog, because endermen are pretty rare. But we got another one, let's go. Come over here and wipe out like half my health, let's go. Yeah. Yeah, you don't actually do that much damage. 
<gasps> a witch! No way, no way, no way. Please, 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 don't fall off. Come on. No! <laughs> That was it. That was gonna be Glowstone Collection. No. <laughs> My dreams. You know those like guardrails at tourist attractions and there's always that one person that drops their phone like through the railing? That's how I feel right now. Skyblock is a ruthless game, but you just, you can't let it beat you. You gotta keep persevering. While we wait for night, let's fish because fishing, fishing is the most exciting thing about this challenge, honestly. Like with everything else, it's just grind and wait, grind and wait, but at least with fishing, it's grind and wait, grind and wait. And then occasionally you get something incredible and then grind and wait and then grind and wait. Only thing I'm worried about is that I'm gonna get soloed by a catfish once we start getting better sea creatures. <sighs> That'd be bad. Yep, oh, here's a... <sighs> Okay, well, <laughs> more guardrails. Maybe the end goal for my channel would be trying to get sponge armor because, you know, you know my channel. What did we just get? A golden apple? <laughs> okay. First healing item of the challenge. Yeah. Believe it or not, I don't just grind. Oh my God, we got a fairy soul. <laughs> Out of anything I can get from fishing, fairy souls are the most useless. Oh, please, why? I, I built like a four block high guardrail. I don't understand. Yes, yes. Oh my God, that did three hearts. Oh my God. Please, please, I deal no damage to this guy. Uh, mm. <laughs> you know it's a bad life when you're losing against a seawalker, dude. <laughs> oh, okay. And we got a lily pad, nice. <gasps> Zombie minion, let's go! <laughs> All right, that's, that's gonna be two very soon. Let's check on our minions real quick. Almost a stack of cobblestone. Nice coal, smelting touch book. There's no way we can craft this. I mean, there's no way I can get paper. Okay, well, it's day now. Let's just do one more day and one more night and then call it an episode. We just need four more bones. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna be honest. I haven't grinded this profile in like a week. <laughs> I, I mean, honestly, it's not a super exciting process. It's just pretty much fishing during the day and mining trees and then killing a bunch of mobs during the night. It's very boring grindy, but the goals, the goals make it worth it. I really want to get a Runan's bow and just not be able to make any arrows because there's no gravel on my island. Let's go. Oh, squid. <laughs> that was a little cool. All right. Yeah, ink sack collection. <laughs> 6,728 coins. Thank you, Hypixel. <laughs> oh, two more skeletons. This could be it. This could be it. Come on. Yes, please. Just die real quick. Yes! 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 Let's go, Skeleton Minion! Okay, placed him down. Uh, I might make a mob grinder a little later, but uh, for now, I'm just gonna have this little guy grind bones, because I just need, I need raw materials more than anything. <gasps> Another witch! Yes! Yes, please, 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 please don't, please don't get your gear knocked off like the last time. Okay. And I got weakness. First potion effect of the game! Die. Yes! Oh, yeah, let's go! Oh my god! Alright, let's just wrap up the episode here before I get carried away. Oh, uh, we made a lot of progress, actually, not gonna lie. Uh, we got more Ender Pearls, we unlocked Ender Pearl Collection, Gunpowder, Glowstone Dust, we got a Gapple for, for some reason. Now, what we're gonna need to do is we're gonna need to get farm animals and we're gonna need to expand our collection. That is the agenda for the next episode, but anyway, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed, I mean, you must be really bored, but but thank you anyway. Like and subscribe. Like and subscribe for my house, dude. I'm the only man that built a house for this challenge, okay? Let me live in my dreams in my house. Also, I think my tree is attacking my house. Anyway, I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.